Hey guys, welcome back to another part in the deep playthrough of Resident Evil 2. Probably the last episode of the weekend, unfortunately. Work is calling again tomorrow. Annoying as hell, but it is what it is. Um, we are slowly making some progress in this uh, greenhouse level. The aim is to kill that uh, yeah, mutated plant over there with some pesticides. And it has us checking out multiple areas and locked rooms to finally be able to gather the stuff we need. Let's first check out what happened over here now. There was, of course, a dude lying about over there. Ah, now this one is open. Hmm. Let's put the vial in. Use. Manual mode engaged. Adjust amount of solution to match cartridge capacity. All right. I have no idea what to do. To match cartridge capacity. Is this my cartridge? Holy shit, what the hell is this? So, I have no idea what's happening here. And what does this one do? Ah. No, my capacity is probably the red um, line over there. Holy shit, what the hell do I need to do? Let's see what... Uh, I think what I need to do put that one there and then over there and now I'm gonna fill it up and then afterwards I will fill a little no. I have no idea what I'm doing uh, so this will be way too much. Let's see what happens if we do it now. Nothing. Um, ah, I think I know what to do. I somehow need to get everything in the big one then in the small one and that will leave a little bit left in the big one so let's do that so it's the big one i am going to fill now with this one no i think i want the other way around right Um, all right, um, I would like to I just need a little bit more stuff. Um, like a 
do a bit more in there like so and now god damn it ah there's still a little bit left in that one that is actually a good thing I think now let's fill up the small one like so and now I just need to put a little bit extra in hmm god damn it yeah in in a higher capacity one so if I turn this one around this should do it I hope here we go nice all right I hardly knew what I was doing but it worked out in the end very nice so we have some pesticides room is clear we need to get to the control room where was that here the sprinkler system that's where we need to get to all right let's be gentle the plant probably is not too happy with our progress. And let's put it in there. Let's see what happens. Error. Solution temperature is outside acceptable range. God damn it. All right, so we need to cool it down and there was like this temperature thingy like low temp testing lab but how the hell do I open those doors? That's the problem. No ID. Um, do I need to do something over here? I don't think so. This is all unlocked. Nothing here. Right, let's get down to the low temp thingy. And beware of liquors. If I die now, I will have to do so much backtracking really will be a bit annoying and here we are hello hello this one was close off I guess yes wasn't there somewhere ah now I remember there's one of those modulation things over there that's what we need Check it out, that purple crutch. It's pretty gruesome. You really can look inside the zombie. It's like a little bit 3D effect. And it's also a lady, so it's like her a pussy. Pretty gruesome. Alright, here we go. Marf. Examine. All right, we are going with Murph. Ah, we're already almost there. Nice. Like so. And let's put it in there. Very nice. Alright, now what? We want 
Yeah, still, those doors are still locked, it seems. But maybe this door over here is now open. Yes, it is. Hello, people. Anything happening? If Mr. X shows up now, I'm going to be so pissed. Thank you. It's pretty advanced stuff they have here going on here. Some more flamer fuel. Why not? And let's put that one in the container and let's get this one back and let's combine this one and combine that one and we're pretty good to go there's a typewriter it's really comes in handy but is there also an ink ribbon God damn it. let's take this one and let's discard the broken knife for now do i have an ink ribbon over here nope but you would think that there should be one, right? No, I already cleared this area. Shouldn't I need to activate something over here? Hello, hello. Like, put some power, relay some power or something. Damn it. Also, this plasticized notice or schedule or whatever it is looks pretty realistic. And yeah, it's a bummer that there are no ink ribbons here. But it is what it is. It's actually a good thing because if I would have an ink ribbon now probably i won't get another one quite uh for some time and i cannot play that long anymore so i prefer not to save now and just save in a little bit um that server room really didn't anything didn't do anything This one is cleared and those doors were locked, I think, still. But let's see. Ah, this one can be opened up now. And what about this door? Ah, this was just back to the lobby, I guess. Yes. All right, we can get to the low temperature thingy. Be mindful, I don't have a lot of healing items. And I'm pretty sure I'm not alone in here. Maybe even some liquors will accompany me. It's quite gross what's in that little bucket over there. And it is quite silent, suspiciously quiet. Man, it looks so realistic, everything, these labs. Anyways, 
We have a zombie over there. And I probably Welcome need... Welcome back, Dr. Lee. You have five new messages. I probably need to done one of those suits. But first let's try to see if I can kill this one with my knife. Whoops. What the? Did that work? Yes. Was that that it? Nope. So funny, they're so persistent. Right, that was it. Yeah, it does take a decent chunk out of. Um, out of the nice knife's durability, but yeah, it is what it is. Um, let's check this out. What the hell is this? Do I need to have a hazmat suit? I don't think so. Man, graphics are really amazingly sharp. Also the HDR doing its thing over here with the brightness a bit, I guess. I'm of course a pretty big layman on these kinds of things, but I try to make the most sense I can. Wayne's lease inbox. Sander Rick Mendoza, subject, what's he up to? Can you believe that bastard card writes? Cool your jets, asshole. Well, I guess he's the boss for now. Anyways, have you seen my helix anywhere? I put the secret on the bottom. Let me know if you find it. Busy guy, huh? So you couldn't make our little meeting. Fine, don't worry about the greenhouse inspection. Instead, I'll give you something real simple to do. Put together the budget estimate for the year after next and get it done tonight. Man, what an asshole. Rick Mendoza, are you alive? We're under attack. People are dead. The east area is cut off. We can't operate the bridge with the wristbands we have here. Where is the bastard Cartwright hiding? Please reply, Rick Mendoza. Plant 43 is going wild. The greenhouse is hell. We need to send someone in there before it's too late. Wayne, how do we stop this thing? You have to help us. Please reply. Rick Mendoza, do you remember Susie, the cheerleader? What a great girl. We were both into her. Of course, she wasn't into nerds. I still have to give you back those comics and games I borrowed, but you might have to wait a while. Alright. So what was handy over here? Um, yeah, here, the helix, the secrets on the bottom, but I already got that secret. Alright. Um, let's get in here. Ugh. Who left the freezer open? All right, we have a zombie over there. We have, is that a film roll? No, it's a little gunpowder. We're still doing fine as regards health. I do expect that dude to come alive. But let's see about that.
Thank you very much. Cooling complete. All right, that dude stays down. It's a good thing. Man, it's such a cool game. It is such a cool game. Also, these zombies, they are like not even that dangerous, but they're still scary. It's all very well done. Like, with this flashlight didn't see that one before probably just didn't notice notice it but they're like they're like even pretty fun to to fight with but still they are pretty menacing they can really dish out damage and that's the cool thing they they are it's a cool combination between scary no by the way where the hell? Oh yeah, I need to get over there. Uh, between scary and fun. And dangerous. Pretty damn cool. Alright, here we go. See you later, plant. Dispensing solution now. All right. That did the trick. Yes. I don't think Warning. You have dispersed a dangerous solution without authorization. Your actions have been logged and you may be subject to disciplinary measures. All right. Anyways, I don't think that the trees really liked what we did to them. And I wonder whether they will now be further mutated and super aggressive. Like that this will be some kind of a boss by a fight. But I hope not. Because if I die here, there's so much backtracking to do. Let's get the flamer ready. Alright, where was that... Ah, those dudes are a goner. Those three people. I think. Right? Yes. I don't see them anymore. But you never know in a game like this. It's really cool. Also, those... That plant over there... They used to be like wide open. Also, that was how that guy was pushed against the glass. Was yeah by like like a yeah, a flower or extremity of the plant like that, like opened up like if like a blossoming flower. And now with all the poison over here, they like closed back up like in a defensive uh, mode. Ah, there you see, there's still one over here. Coming. No idea. Yes. There's one over there at the back.
Very nice, senior staff. No way! Him again? No way! This is not what I wanted. No way! Let's get to the server room. God damn it, I have so much. Um, oh, fuck me, so much. Um, progress to lose here. Ah, uh, no way. Get the G fire sample in the west area. No idea where I'm in. I'm in the east area. Okay. Senior staff, personal computer. Uh, this will be such a bummer if I die here now. Man. He will most likely relentlessly chase me around over here. All right, I could get up this stairs and then I uh, will be over here in the lobby but I still wanted to see this senior staff PC let's just try that let's first listen whether he is near yes I do hear him Such an annoying dude. He could very well also be taking the stairs, by the way. There are also jump scares that he suddenly... Holy shit. What's up with this one? Flamer doesn't make that much noise. Son of a bitch. I can do this. All right, that's a good one. Uh, guys, I am hitting the 30 minute mark. So I do have to end the episode here and continue in the next one just until I get an ink ribbon and then I need to hit the sack and start the working week. Uh, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this one. We are with annoying Mr. X on our tail, but yeah, let's just see what uh, happens. Hope to see you in the next one. And for the meantime, always keep on gaming. See you later.